Dozens of bulldogs are looking for loving homes. They were rescued from a puppy mill where they lived in horrible conditions. And CBS2 Orange County reporter Michelle Geely is live in Westminster now with details on how you can adopt one of them. I think she's holding some or she's got wow. some with her, oh, Michelle. Look at guys. <laughs> Cute. This is just a sample, just a sample. It is the first day that adoption applications, Rick and Pat, have been accepted here for these French and English bulldogs. These are little Frenchies here. And I am told that they have received here at the shelter hundreds of applications. People have lined up and they've gone online for a chance to own one. <laughs> They snort and slobber, and bulldog fanatics are lining up for the chance to adopt one. So you're willing to kind of go through this long process? Of course, because it's a cute little dog, and you know, you're friends forever. You know, the fur buddies, you know. <laughs> They've been neglected. Many are sick. All of them were seized from an Orange County puppy mill. The folks at Westminster Adoption Group and Services, WAGS for short, are helping 75 antisocial French and English bulldogs become fabulous pets. One little rascal at a time. The support has been massive. The, the outpouring of the community. We have people from Australia that want these dogs, from England that want these dogs. I mean, it's just been huge for our little tiny shelter in Westminster <laughs> to give all this attention, but it's awesome. Because bulldogs are known to have medical issues, they're allergic, have chronic skin conditions and problems with their eyes, ears, and lungs, the shelter amended its application to be sure prospective owners can care for the pups. And these dogs are even worse off. They lived in filthy cages and barely saw the sun. But Zach Ray is up to the challenge and hopes to get one. I, you know, I rescue a dog. I'd like to uh, help them out, you know. So if they need medical attention, we'll help them out. Next week, the prospective owners who receive callbacks can actually come see the dogs because they haven't seen them yet. They're being nursed back to health. They can give their first, second, and third choices. Now, the little ones, the younger pups, are $800. The more mature bulldogs, $500. But that is still a fraction of what you pay at a breeder. That's the latest live in Westminster. Back to you.